Hey, welcome back tonight. We're going to be talking about network segmentation uh, as we continue our cybersecurity awareness uh, security video streak. Um, what is network segmentation? So network segmentation is the intentional construction kind of architecture and design of a network that splits up information to keep it more secure generally. Right. Um, you'll often hear the terms north, south versus east and west. North and south is from the internet into your network and east and west is between segments or lateral movement across your, your local area network. Um, both of these are very important to kind of keep in mind when you're designing and architecting a network environment. Um, obviously, the internet has a lot of threats. That's where all the bad guys are. Hopefully, once they get into your network, um, they can move around if you let them. So one way to prevent this is to segment the inside of your network so it looks more like this, right? Instead of the internet and in being the only real barrier, you create segments between different kinds of data or different kinds of devices uh, using your firewall or multiple firewalls if you have to um, that create restrictions between different portions of your network as well as the internet. So we might have a very low security area, like a guest network device or an IoT device uh, environment. Uh, these devices probably need access to the internet, but in the case of something like IoT, for example, maybe you picked up a nice set of lights and you like that they have a smart timer and you like that you control the color of them from your phone, probably don't maybe trust that those LEDs are going to be secure enough to put on the same segment of your network as maybe your PCI compliance based data, your cardholder information and things like that. Um, so to help that and to make sure you get both of what you need, you need PCI data and you need IoT devices or you want IoT devices, you segment the networks to protect them from the less secure environments. Um, same thing with your standard corporate data, your desktops, your laptops, uh, or guests, right? Like you might have people coming into your office for meetings. You want to be able to allow them to the in, uh, get access to the internet from their laptops. Great, that's okay. But they're not corporate desktops or laptops, so you shouldn't trust them. So you put them on their own network segment. Um, even things you do kind of trust, like a corporate desktop or a corporate managed laptop where it's your endpoint security, it's your monitoring tool set. That's okay, but a desktop and a laptop is more likely to get compromised generally because it's a human interacting on it, right? Humans are going to get fished. They're going to get tricked. They're going to accidentally download malware. It's just part of existing in IT. So to slow down an attacker, once they do get a foothold on your desktops or your laptops, you segment the network so there's one more barrier, barrier before they can get over to a server or, or even uh, worse, one of your compliant spaces. So network segmentation is the idea that you're using things like firewalls and access control lists and, uh, to separate out different kinds of information on your network and even different kinds of devices in hopes that in the event a bad guy does get in from the internet into your local area network, there's more layers of these controls to slow them down from moving laterally. Uh, there's more for them to learn if they do want to try to traverse the networks because they'll have to figure out routes to get there. And there's more tripwires, you know, in place. So if they do try to get from, say, that corporate desktop over to a sensitive data server, maybe they trip a couple more rules on that firewall that give your team a bit more heads up that something weird is going on. And that's about what that's what you're aiming for, right? You're not only trying to defend, but you need to keep detection in mind along, along the way. So network segmentation happens with that, uh, helps with that kind of stuff as well. So that's our concept for the night, network segmentation. Uh, remember, north-south is from the internet to your local area network. East-west is lateral movement throughout your network. Um, keep an eye on both and make sure that as you design networks and separate out your data, you're following you know, rules like least privilege and least access and concepts like zero trust. Um, so you can keep your data safe. Have a good night, everyone.